Capital of Ukraine, my name is Viktor Fursov, and today November 9th, 2018, and we are just observing some interesting mites, which I show you in aquarium just between these green algae, these fibers, these are algae, and these rounded objects, these are mites, and these are flower mite, a car zero. If you are interested, follow this video we can show you how it looks like and who are these strange mites. Actually I have shown them just in a honey but I can repeat that in a honey we are not living. We have been shown only just for fun and just the same here. We are not living in aquarium. We are just here to be shown just between these algae because it's easier to show them not in very active position, because they are moving very fast, so it's easier to stop them, like here, and to show them just like this. Some of them were active, some of them were moving, but not all of these mites. And where did I find them? I found them in the culture, in the culture of uh, rice with the Lcetophilus oryza, yes, and together with Cetophilus there is always for some dust after growing larvae and adults of these pest weevils in the laboratory culture sometimes and very often all these cereal mites appear because they are growing in a high humidity, in an increased humidity so they are eating some mushrooms, some fungi on the surface of substrate so that's why if we have some subject and substrate like grains after cereal mites, after cereal weevils, Cetophilus oryza, these mites were eating flour, were eating some grains. So it's easy to show them in this magnification. One ten on the object and ten on the ocular, so one hundred magnification. Just show you again some one more. Here this is a surface with a just with air. So we can show them some of them you are moving. So 100 magnification. So some of them were dead, some of still alive, so they're actively moving. So you can see what the danger of this mice because they are covered with this setter. Definitely this set is not very pleasant stuff, so they are very useful for mites because for the, it helps them to distribute everywhere around like small plankton in the air, so uh, migrating easily with substrate, with different materials because of this hairs and like plankton in the air, but if they come to your breathing air that's not very good, it's can be a subject of allergy, so some people develop allergy if they have these mites in their working or living conditions. Hopefully you do not have it, so it's possible to check it, but usually these cereal mites or dust mites were absent in your room, absent in your laboratory, in your working office, because if your room, if your office are cleaned, so if your surface is clean, no substrate for food for these mites, they must eat something if there is no food, there are no cakes, there are no bread, there are no flour anywhere around in the stock, just open, open with open for air for appearance of these mites, so we will not come inside and if this flower is dry with a low humidity they are also not developing. They are developing only in a wet flower, in a, on the surface of a wet a substrate, in a high humidity, in a flower with a humidity more than 17% humidity. So that's why I don't worry, usually they do not exist everywhere around. But here they are in an aquarium, because I got some water from aquarium with some algae, with this green algae. Just like a line, this is a green algae, so that's why they're under my 
out of the sleep on the on my last slide and I show them some of them dead, some of them alive, some of them were crawling around. But after observation they are going just to sewage system, so I destroy and them and clean everything around. So you can see here some infusoria swimming in the water from aquarium, but dot mites were already dead. Sorry about it, but this is just for education, just for fun, but just for observation how they look like, how this dust mite or cereal mite, Acaro cereal, look like, because it is important to know your enemy in the face, to know how it looks like, and do not afraid it, or at least if you are cleaning everything, if you clean your area, your room, your house clean, you need, you do not need to worry about this stuff, despite it looks pretty strange, like aliens. So I clean my hands, so and clean my lab equipment, so we will not come to the laboratory from the box, from the jar with a culture of cereal weevil. So and cereal weevils also culture is going to be destroyed. So no culture, no mites. We do not distribute any way around. So thank you for watching. This is already magnification 400. Okay, 40 on the object and 10 on ocular. So that's 400 magnification of my microscope Olympus. And thank you for watching. I hope it was interesting for you. Don't worry about mites. Just clean your room, clean the surface of your different materials, your table, and you will be free of this dangerous pest, because they are not growing on clean area. So thank you for your interest, for your curiosity, press likes, write your comments and ask your questions. Bye bye! See you soon on my channel, I will show you more stories about interesting strange creatures. Good luck and see you soon on my channel.